this town Doing that thing I do Running from the truth once again every time we do this we always have to say unfortunately we had to leave the previous state which was florida whoa is that it oh no that's a private jet i thought it was a military jet <laughs> and we finally arrived in texas. texas we are in the lone star state texas. and we are here at the historic stockyards and we're going to have a walk through and check out where they used to like run all the cattle and do all that sort of stuff with the places museum it's a vibe there's yeah. dining there's all sorts of shows play. And it's really cool. It's like this old school Main Street. Oh, look, oh there's, there's the bullhorns already. Oh, there's full decorations. Oh, we got some uh, fireworks. Oh he's, oh, he's cracking a whip. Oh, this guy's the pro. Whoa. That's insane. That is the longest pair of horns I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> His name is Maverick. Maverick. Wow. Wow. That's his brother. Oh. No. That's his brother. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> That's a nice brother. <laughs> wow. I am absolutely blown away by this place. I'm actually like, so I'm cool. I'm speechless, like my jaw is like on the floor. I didn't know it was all of this old, like old town authentic, like Wild West feel. I know. It's so amazing. And real Isn't that us? Uh, yeah. Wow. Stockyards Rodeo Championship. I know. I feel like I'm in that movie eight seconds. Oh yeah, true. <laughs> what? The biggest bar in the world. Bro, oh look, look, they've even got a full arcade for this guy. What? <laughs> Play some pool dance. Yeah, race you in a massive, supercar game. Massive Pac-Man. Oh, that is the biggest Pac-Man I've ever seen in my oh, life. What? Is it? Oh yeah, bull riding. True. Bull riding. Wow. Did you say we're at Billy Bob's? Yeah, we're at Billy Bob's. We're at Billy Bob's. Yeah. The biggest bar in the entire world. Biggest hockey What is a hockey top? What is that line dance? This, it goes on for miles. I know. Oh, we just literally stumbled upon this like arena. What? Wow. Just a full on indoor arena. That's insane. Probably be some mean rides in here at one point. The Panhandle Arena. Seen many battles between man and beast. I just realized that. What? The bar has a bull riding arena inside. I know, it's crazy. The bar has a bull riding arena <laughs> inside. So what? How does it? How did all those words even come out of my mouth? It's just that everything's bigger in Texas. Everything really is bigger. Oh, another beast. They should start a new sport: bear riding. <laughs> Stumbled upon here. Wow, werewolf! It's like well and truly into Halloween season now. This is so 
Oh my goodness, this is crazy. Oh, I love this. We don't get pumpkins. We just don't get pumpkins like this. I know. If you want to like, the, the hilarious thing about uh, New Zealand is if you want to decorate your pumpkins for Halloween, you just have to go down to the supermarket and just buy whatever pumpkins they have there. And they don't look like this. No. Nope. They're tiny and... Tiny. They look like that. Tiny and green. Yeah, tiny they and green. Like we don't get those really amazing orange pumpkins. Wow. Look like this. Yeah. Man, I mean, take your selection, eh? Yeah, they come Wow. Oh yeah. Got your little pile of pumpkins there. Nice. Wow. And we also saw some amazing uh, Halloween decorations in Key West um, in bottom of Florida. When we were walking past some houses, I mean the whole, you couldn't even see the house. It was just the whole house was just covered. And I'll, I'll probably put a picture up on the screen of what the Halloween decorations there look like. But it was amazing. Even on the roof, the whole roof was covered with decorations. Look, they've got pink, pink pumpkins. What? It's a pink one. That's... You can call them pink. Oh, no, I want that pink. one. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah. Wow. This is epic. Look at the size of that pumpkin. I know. They're literally everywhere. It's outrageous. Like, look at my foot compared to the pumpkin. Huge. <laughs> and they're all around America at the moment. I know. <laughs> take it. <laughs> take, 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 take the photo. Take the photo, quick. <laughs> take the photo. Take the photo. Oh, is this a video? <laughs> Bro. Those are insane. Denzi just pointed them out. Wow. Oh, is that an eagle on the back? Oh my goodness. Those are like the boots of all boots. Bro. Absolute champion if you're wearing them, eh? <laughs> Me and um, Nades actually watched a program on Netflix about all the, the uh, PBR professional bull riding. And the Texas Rattlers were one of the teams. So we've actually got all the gears here for one of the teams now. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I know. There it is. Texas Rattler. So cool. So we think we've got the ones chosen for the rodeo tonight. Oh, look at those, man. Digital camera with the oh, US flags. Bro, they're so okay. Oh, Atlanta's got some. She's got the hat. definitely an option, but I think I'm going to look around a bit more, see if we can find a better, you know, better pair. They're pretty awesome. Just feel like I need to find the perfect hat. What are we doing here? Too small. Too big. Can't get it right. <laughs> nah, but in all seriousness, is the hat good, Jess? Yeah. Look at that. Howdy. <laughs> I've always wanted to do that. <laughs> oh, I love this. This is my jam. These are my people. Oh, there's a wall full of boots under all the horns here. I need to find a pair. Come on. Which one is the special pair? Oh, so much to choose from. Which one will be the your New Zealand boots? <laughs> Bro. There's so many. It's insane. I think you should try this. Really? I want to try some with an eagle on it. You know, my old pappy used to say, if you don't have a picture to prove it, Lanta. it probably never happened. So come up, meet one of these guys, get up there, get your picture made. So this is a national headquarters for the National Bull Riding Association. Every Thursday, they have their own special rodeo, which is bull riding. Tonight they're having that. People say, Ed, do you do this for show? No, this is our heritage, folks. This is what we're all about. See, after the Civil War, when the folks came back to Texas, our economy was devastating. We had no jobs. We did have one thing the other southern states didn't have, and that was cattle. When they made their way down to South Texas, they found a herd of longhorns walking around absolutely free, 
and they numbered over five and a half million. Now that might sound like a good deal, but there was two million. Anybody could get a free cow. So if you spent all day, but you're going out, you'd be lucky to get one to four dollars. Welcome to the stockyards, but most of all, welcome to our cattle drive. We're gonna see some cattle. Yeah. Nice. Oh, here they come. Whoa. Look at that one. Oh my gosh, the horns. Whoa. Look at the horns. Wow. That is insane. Okay, that's officially the biggest set of horns I've ever seen. Wow. That's insane. Oh my goodness. This is insane. How do they not get headaches? Wow. That's it. That's it. Wow. Wow. Bro, I could not believe the size of the horns that, on those that things. That's the second one, eh? I know. I was like, how have you not got a headache? Yeah. How does it hold How, up? how is he not going like this? Like, whoa, whoa, whoa like the balance. No, so cool. <laughs> that is so sick. That was awesome. Wow. That was some good cattle. That was some big time Texas stuff. I sure do miss her and what we had. There ain't no future in looking back So I keep on rolling and moving on I hope she comes back, but if she don't I